Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm sharing with you all our morning routine in quarantine. So let's get started. So my morning usually starts with Kavir waking up for his first feed. This day it happened around 5.57 a.m. So I just pick him from his crib. We come to our bed and then we snuggle for a bit. I give him lots and lots of kisses because morning time is definitely the best time of the day. And he's always very happy and smiley baby. So then I change his diaper and the reason why I change his diaper before the feed is that uh, if I do it otherwise, so he's gonna be awake and I don't want that. So once the diaper is changed, I again uh, swaddle him. This way he sleeps better and then I give him his bottle and again I give him lots and lots of kisses because morning Kabir is my favorite Kabir. And when he's uh, done with his feet, I just put him back to his crib. Most of the days, I do need to rock him. He just falls back to sleep on his very own. And then I come out of the room as quietly as possible and straight away go to the washroom. So once my bathroom work is done, I straight away go to the second spare room that we have to get dressed for the day. I change my night clothes and wear some comfy real life clothes. And I know this is something if I don't do it the first thing in the morning, I'm not going to do it in the entire day. So yeah, I just uh, keep it very simple. I comb my hair, I apply some moisturizer because hey, I live in Canada and it's still a little cold in here. I apply this Nivea soft moisturizer, a little bit of lip balm and ta-da, I'm done. And then I make my way to the kitchen because hey, this mama needs a caffeine without which I cannot function in the morning. And I know this is not the greatest of the habit but I just want my caffeine. So if you can't tell, I'm very particular about the way I want my coffee to taste like. I'm adding some unsweetened cashew milk, a spoon of coconut sugar because I'm trying to lessen my sugar intake and then some must needed frothing. So the reason I wake up this early and do not go back to sleep is one, I have always been a morning person. Second, I want some time for myself just to relax, sip my daily dose of happiness and do nothing. And also, I can get a lot of stuff done in those few hours when Kabir is still sleeping. Well, you're gonna see that. So most of the nights we make sure to clean all the dishes and it was the time to keep them to their designated place so they are all organized. And next, it was time to do some laundry, just Kabir's clothes because he had a small blowout the night before and I always use the Purex baby detergent for Kabir's clothes. So when I do laundry, I usually like to do it in the morning hours because this is the time when uh, the most of the machines are free and also I'm awake, I have some time, so yeah, why not? So I have some indoor plants here, I'm just watering them. So 
so it was 7:45 ish am and kabir was still sleeping so i decided to paint my nails because um, it was it was needed actually and it doesn't happen often but just did it And here I am doing some social networking thing, Insta, messages, WhatsApp, all those things. And then it was time to do some editing. And now, as you all see, Kabir is slowly waking up. then me and jeet go to meet our wiki wiki kabir so now when it's all quarantine time jeet is working from home he takes his break the first one when kabir gets up for the day and we just cuddle make sure he starts his day all happy happy then it was time for some much needed water so i try to give him water as frequently as possible then we are changing his diaper wiping his face uh, and then applying some baby moisturizer and we use a vino baby moisturizer and then it was time to put on his first pair of clothes for the day and here comes the proud face So once he's all dressed up I brush his teeth and uh, this is definitely a struggle because boyfriend wants to do it on his very own so I just gave him his body lotion you know to keep him occupied and here I'm brushing his hair which is growing so fast and then I put him onto his crib and make our bed and to be very honest i do it 99% of time but then sometimes it just doesn't happen and it doesn't happen so i just don't want to give a you know false impression that my days are all perfect it is not and you're going to see this and the later stage of the vlog that my days are even not perfect
So then we make our way to the play area for some independent play time. And this doesn't last long but it lasts somewhere around 10 to 15 minutes which gives me enough time to make his breakfast. And for today Kabir's breakfast, I'm making some mini pancakes and he absolutely loves them. But before I give him his favorite pancakes, I'm just trying with some uh, blueberries. He doesn't eat much. He eats a couple of them and then he starts playing with them and then I'm giving him his real breakfast. So the reason I gave him the blueberries first is that if I you know turned it otherwise so he's not gonna even touch the blueberries at least he ate couple of them. So now I'm giving him his pancakes and he loves them. He just finished them all by himself. Also, whenever I make any breakfast for myself, which is you know different than his breakfast, I try giving him some. And here I made some smoothie for myself, so I'm just trying with him, and he loved it too. And here I'm just tackling some of his bottles that he used before. And then it was time to clean his face and he wasn't he wasn't liking it. So once breakfast is done, we head to the living area. There we play for a while and as you can tell he is starting to stand with the help of whatever he can uh, grab. So these days he doesn't want to be held or limited to one particular area for long. So then we move to his jumper area. So we played there for about 30 minutes and uh, then he started getting fussy and I knew it was the time for his first morning nap. And then I make his bottle and head over to the bedroom and the formula I use for Kabir is Nestle Good Star Stage 2. So most of the days we read books together as a family and at this point of time Jeet joins us too. And also Kabir chooses his own book that he wants to read. Also the reason why I am swaddling Kabir in this uh, sleep sack is because he sleeps much better. So 
then we read for a while we get our much needed daily cuddles and then kabi goes down for his first nap which concludes our morning routine So this is it for today's video guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to see you guys very soon in my next one. Until then, stay happy, stay safe. Bye guys.